Hello everyone and welcome back to Cattails! And we are here with our young kitten Mossy who is currently dashing from bush to bush. <gasps> Look, there's another butterfly, let's go get it! Chasing butterflies, oh it flew through my den. Come here, come here, I got it, all right. Chasing butterflies and searching through the bushes and introducing herself to these new cats that she has met. So poor little Mossy here was a young kitten bought from a pet store and she was taken home but quickly rejected by the parents who were not very happy that their child brought a cat home, I suppose. She was tossed out into the forest on the side of the road, but it turns out that she is born for the wild. She is having much more fun searching out and trying to collect up the different plants and hunting behind every leaf than she ever did when she lived back at home with the little girl who had took her in as, uh, as a pet. So we are a little sad to have left our former life behind, but I'm really curious to start poking around and building a life here in the forest column. So without further ado, let's go ahead and introduce ourselves to the other cats here, like Missy. Um, who are you and what do you want from me? All right, and it looks like we have a black heart with Missy right now. I think that this inspiration is kind of from the Harvest Moon games, where the more gifts that you give to these certain eligible cats, then the higher up the heart color goes so that it'll change from black to better heart colors. And eventually we might be able to have kittens with any of the cats that we choose who have those little hearts. That's my guess at least. And we can't have kittens in this alpha version, so hold on to your kits and don't get too excited. But that is a feature that is definitely going to be in the game game and available in the future, so that'll be really fun. Look, you don't know me, I don't know you, so let's get one thing straight. I'm Missy, and I'm the most important cat in the forest. Got it? Now leave me be. You're wasting my time. All right, Missy, that's fine. Try not to scratch at your tail before we walk past. But that is Missy. We did know her from the early Access Alpha. Same with Cool Ember over here. It's very interesting because none of the cats have an immediate gender. So it's so funny to see the people who are like, Ember's a boy. Ember's a girl. And you could just pick whatever one you feel like you want the cat to be. Hi there. Have you come to check out my fine wares? I think I'm going to make Ember a girl this time. Have we met before? Allow me to introduce myself. They call me Member, and I run the store around here. I've got lots and lots of stuff for sale, so stop by if you need anything. Hope to see you around. All right, let's see, and let's talk, Ember. Always nice to chat with a valued customer like yourself. So Ember must also be a collecting obsessed cat because we like to collect things too. Ember, you and I will be best of friends. Look at all those little mews, which are the currency in the game that are hiding behind her. Most cats just stop by to buy stuff and leave, so it's nice that you're sticking around. It gets lonely here sometimes. And I wonder if the stars also represent like the level of friendship. Sometimes I even talk to my inventory out of boredom. <laughs> Oh, poor Ember. All right, let's see. And I wonder if that means like talking to the dead mice. <laughs> Great. Would you like to buy or sell? Excellent. Take your time to look around. These are bargain prices and items of exceptional quality. I wonder where she got into the habit of actually like selling and buying things, bringing in a sense of currency and a whole economy to the forest. Let's see, mouse, dove, rabbit, golden seal, and marigold. And then there's also the colors and inventory expansion. That's so awesome. That will add six more slots to the inventory. Hello, that is definitely gonna be one of our goals. Valerian and raspberries. Just imagine the garden we'd be able to make. I would love that. Lots and lots of different pelt colors that you can actually unlock. There's also, oh my gosh, a little cat sweater and a bell and a scarf and a nightcap. Oh my goodness. I totally wanna to get that bell. Even though the bell would be really impractical for hunting prey. It'd be funny if when you wore the spell, maybe it's little like ringer part has gone missing. But I want that bell. I think little Mossy, our little Mossy and Ember are both collecting cats. They both must absolutely love to collect stuff. All right, and I'm getting kind of hungry, but let's come over and say hello to Mayor again. Greetings. Stay sharp out there and don't wander too far from the borders. The fence of thickets that guards our home was built up over the course of many years. It has repelled invaders, floods, and predators on more than a few occasions. It serves our domain well. Hmm. I mean, everyone's so nice here. It's really hard to imagine that there could be mean cats in this forest right now. Oh my gosh, Doc, your eyes. Hey there. How are you doing today? You know, I don't believe we've met before. Name's Doc. I look after the sick and wounded cats around these parts. I've got herbs, medicines, and remedies for just about every kind of ailment you can think of. If you're ever feeling icky, inside or out, you come and find me. I've got whatever you need to get back in tip-top shape. 
pleasure to meet you. I'll be seeing you around, I'm sure. Oh my goodness, Doc. Wow, okay, that was fun. Oh, Lyris, hello. Good day to you, my rose. Ah, like a fresh breeze in the thick of spring, so a new face brings life to my soul. We have not met before, have we? My name is Lyris. I do hope you will stop by again. It has been such a pleasure to meet one as exquisite as you. Oh my goodness. All right, so we're having fun meeting and greeting with the other cats. It'd be really fun if when you got your relationship high enough, you could go into the different dens. That would be kind of adorable. But all right, I'm hungry, so let's go find something to eat. <gasps> Mushrooms, they're so cute. Oh my gosh, and look, there's some golden seal. Yes, all right, we're gonna collect all of the things because I love collecting. Uh, oh, there's some prey. Guys, look at the size of him. He's so big. All right. Oh, did I get him? Ah, he got away. All right, I need to get a little closer, I think. So Mossy is learning how to hunt in the forest today. So let's focus on surviving, and then we can focus on collecting up some fun things. What the heck, a doodle? What's happening here? Hello? I don't understand. Help, help, attacked. Oh my gosh, I think the forest colony is winning. I just walked into a forest colony. Okay, th the battle, yay. It, are these Mews? Cool. What? You get Mews for helping to lead the fight? Hmm? Need something? Hard times call for desperate actions. Hmm? Blizzard? You ever eaten a berry? I don't like how they taste. Oh, and then there's some food right here. Very unfortunate little chipmunk that has decided to approach. Oh, I think he's running for it. He's like, oh my gosh, there's so many cats, run. So I think we just ended up walking into some sort of battle out of the blue. Also, I definitely need to eat this chipmunk because I'm getting very hungry. All right, so let's go ahead and om nom nom chomp that chipmunk, or it's a squirrel. Okay, I'm gonna eat it. Yay, all right, now I'm feeling better. I'm just a little bit hungry. Oh, that squirrel saw me. And we might try creeping up on that one. Oh, a butterfly! I'm gonna creep up on this! All right, got it. another azure butterfly that I can decorate my den with. And yeah, it looks like the other prey got away. But I wonder what that fight was about. I'm feeling like everybody is being a little bit, a little bit lenient at letting me know just what the political situation between the different colonies might happen to be in this forest. But, oh well, I'm a young kit. I'm not worried about things like that. I just wanna come and eat this chipmunk. That's my goal for the day. All right. Got it. Ah, oh, no, he got away. I probably, oh, there's another butterfly. I want it, I want it. Come back here. Come back here, little butterfly. I'm gonna get you. All right, I got him. Tiger butterfly, there we go. I think little Mossy's goal is going to be to collect absolutely everything, all of the insects, all of the plants, maybe even some of the different types of prey that she can possibly get her paws on. Oh, I can't believe I, did, I missed that one. Oh no, it saw me. All right, so she's definitely got to work on her hunting. And it's really fun to be able to collect up <gasps> fireflies. Oh, I think she'd be so excited just wanting to collect up fireflies like it's nobody's business. Oh, it's a green one. Yes, a green firefly. Oh, there's a fish. Mossy, can you get the fish? Ah, it got away. Mossy's really bad at this. Oh, look, and there's a new, a new little plant. <gasps> Lavender, sweet. All right, well, we've managed to collect up quite a few things and just not a lot of prey. So let's try sprinting, and we might try wandering back to our home. Wow, so this is the southeast forest. There's so much to explore. I think that there's actually, yeah, here's the map. So here's the map, and then let's see. Oh, there's a battle raging over at the Rushing Rocks. The forest and the Mystic Colony are fighting over it. Look, and you can see the different uh, control levels that each colony has. This is the control that the Forest Colony has. And then there's the Mountain Colony, a locked area, but you can take over their colony. That's so fascinating. And then here's the Mystic. So you have Forest, Mountain, and Mystic Colonies. It looks like there's a delta. Oh, wow, I wonder if there's a little beach down there. We have so much exploring to do with Mossy, but she needs to survive. So I think we need to work on some of our uh, base skills, that's for sure. Let's see, what about, oh, there was a little mouse. Oh man, I could have had food. Oh, there's another mouse. All right, come on, Mossy, you've got this. Ah, oh, he saw me. <laughs> Poor Mossy, we might want to send her home. Let's send her home for the night because it's already so late. We'll let her rest in the den. Do we have anything I could give anybody as a gift? 
I don't know if the mayor would want these fireflies as gifts, but we have a whole bunch of cool fireflies and butterflies. Nice. We got some valerian and some lavender. You can use its strong scent to gain a power for your colony in an area. Interesting. I wonder if I'm going to want to dabble in those politics. And then energizes and invigorates cats. That's what the valerian does. And the golden seal helps if you have been injured. We had a little bit of a scratch, but I don't think it's anything our kitten is going to bother paying attention to. All right. Well, let's go to sleep. And then we'll figure out what to do in the morning. Ah, oh, there we go. All right. Yes, 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 yes. So we'll just curl up. Look at this big area. We could fill it up with so many things. So much that Mossy might want to decorate with. Oh my, it's so quiet on a rainy day like this. Can I put down... Uh, let's see. All right. What if I want to, like, place these down? What if I want to drop them? Oh, can I not put the fireflies down? It can be identified at night. Oh no, I can't put the butterflies down either. I really wanted to drop them to decorate inside of the den. Or what if I do this? Oh wait, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Dun dun dun. And just like that, Mossy is able to decorate in her den. I gotcha now. All right, so we would want to grab the green firefly. I wonder, I think because the firefly is like no longer, oh, it is lighting things up a little bit. That is so cool. It still has a little bit of the firefly light left over and we can decorate our den with that. Whoa, sorry. There we go. Look at that, guys. <gasps> Mossy, I think she's so excited. So excited to have started collecting different things. Uh, no, 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 I don't want to do, I don't want to do that. There we go. Look at that. That's so fun. I really love that it lights the area up. All right, and then we'll drop another one right over here and right there. Nice! We can start pretending that the fireflies aren't actually deceased, that they just hang out inside of our den because it's nice and dark. And then I think I'm going to go ahead and put down the lavender as well, just as little decoration pieces because I love decorating dens like this. There we go. And I might, I might keep the valerian. I might give it as a gift, but I think that's pretty useful. There we go. And let's head out. We're really hungry now. So I wonder if I'm desperate. Let's come talk to Ember and see if we can get some food. Hi there. Have you come to check out my fine wares? Uh, let's see what we could sell my golden rod and my butterflies for. You can actually sell them for quite a bit. So I'm going to go ahead and sell these. Nine mews. Wonderful. I have 16 whole mews. That's enough for like 18 million meals, right? Right? No, it's probably going to be enough for like two mice. Um, let's see. Yep, I can actually get a mouse. Thank goodness. So I'm going to go ahead and buy a mouse this time. Just to make sure I don't starve to death because I'm starting to get very hungry. And then we'll come back and we'll talk to the mayor and Ember and everybody else soon. But we need to work on our skills. So I wonder. Oh, we have 34 experience points. So let's go ahead and upgrade our hunting. Used for finding, tracking, and killing prey. At higher levels, a hunter will come better at pouncing upon small creatures. Focus on, hinder, focus on his or her meal faster and unlock a scent compass to point out nearby prey. Man, a scent compass would be so useful. Let's go ahead and upgrade this. And we have just upgraded our passive hunting skill. So hopefully we're learning to become slightly better hunters than before. So I think today we're going to explore around some of... Ooh, we're in the fairy wood. Oh, look, there's some more plants. All right, going to snag that golden seal don't mind if i do don't mind if i do and we're wandering around the fairy wood today so let's see if we can find any food maybe we'll find some fairies to eat oh there's something okay we don't want them to get me or we don't want them to see us but i need to get close enough ah oh, to jump i'm not a very good hunter but we'll figure it out eventually oh what's this merry old nice all right I think Mossy is just super excited to have, like, so many different spots. Ah, uh, okay, come on, come on, come on. And then wait, and then bounce. Oh, yes, I got a fish. I got a whole trout. That's so exciting. <gasps> Look, another plant. Also very exciting. It was catnip. Oh, my gosh, that's so cool. But I think Mossy is really excited to be able to wander around and just explore and pick up new things. She's definitely a collector cat. So that's going to be my first goal. To collect everything we possibly can and fill our den with glorious, glorious plants, fireflies. Let's go ahead and eat this trout. A river fish with white speckles on its back. All right, I'm going to eat it. Nice! It didn't fill me up as much as I thought it would, but a pretty good start. Oh, rat! Oh my gosh, look how cool a rat looks! What an awesome cat! Hard times call for desperate actions. 
I wonder what's going on that makes everybody everybody so concerned. Oh, look, and there's Sea Lily. Hello, Sea Lily. We are strong. We could push into enemy territory if we wanted. Why are we waiting? Oh my gosh. Look, there's Romeo and Torch. Oh, I'm meeting all of these new cats. This is so cool. Ever tried frog? Can't stand the stuff myself, but some cats love it. Romeo? If you don't mind, I've got a lot to do today. Hmm. There's a lot more cats here than I thought. So I think that we've been recruited, but I wonder if they're going to require more of their new young recruit pretty soon. I think maybe just like the basics of can they even stay alive long enough to be useful is probably a good question. So let's see. New cats. And the forest lake, huh? All right. Well, I think Mossy's excitement over collecting butterflies and flowers is definitely starting to build up. And now we've got some questions about possibly exploring. I mean, you know, we've mostly run into nice cats other than that one really weird cat. So surely the whole world is full of nice cats. Look at the mouse. <laughs> we just chased the mouse into the water. Sorry, little guy. There we go. We got some licorice root. But I mean, it can't be like this whole world is not full of friendly animals, right? I'm sure we'll run into more cats from the Mystic and Mountain Colony and everything will be fine. So I don't think Mossy would be very concerned. We're going to focus on getting her hunting down and on starting to explore all of the different places out in this world next time, I think. Oh, and there's some more catnip. And also building up the absolute best garden. Oh, yeah, look at that. The absolute best garden inside of our den. All right, so I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.